All right, man, it looks like it might be Jalen Dern, Jay Ivy K, Cunningham, or Bust next year for the Pistons. Let's talk about it. Thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, next subscribe button, it's the bell icon button, hit all notifications, increase your chance, get notifications, we go live or drop video now. Um, obviously, they can bring in a rookie. I don't like any of them power fours they got going, Villanova, Houston, or the kid from University of Central Florida. I don't like none of them for what I've seen. I ain't did no deep dive, and I don't even know if I am going to do a deep dive. I don't like none of them. Just going to be real. Looking the way they shoot and they play, I'm good. <laughs> I'm just going to say it straight up down. I'm good. But, um, but yeah, it looked like, you know, a lot of people saying if the Pistons tank again, you know, Benjamin Foe sent me something that I think our pick is protected. Uh, if it falls outside that protection, it goes to the Knicks. It's, it's deep protected. I think it's like 18, top 18 protected or something like that. But um, if they go through another 20 win season or sub, to, I think if it's anything less than 30, Troy Weaver should be fired. I don't even care how I go, you know. And he can sit there and say, well, I wasn't hoping, you know, I didn't hope to win the lottery. He's a fucking liar. Excuse my language. But for him, you know, it's gonna rest on the it's gonna rest on the shoulders of Kay Cunningham, Jalen Dern, and Jaden Ivey. And if he continues to sit there and try to play with the church's money and try to put James Wiseman in there, try to force Isaiah Stewart in the lineup, try to force Marvin Bagley in the lineup, try to force Killian Hayes in there, he's gonna die with his guns. He gonna die with those with those with them cap guns and them pellet guns. I don't even I, I think it's inaccurate calling Killian a pellet gun. Oh super soaker. He gonna die with that, and I and I just looking at how he moving, um, and some of the names that's attached to the Pistons, like they don't really have a great idea of what they need. Like you hear, like they're interested in Kuzma. Okay, why would I go out there and get somebody who don't shoot the ball well and who don't defend well and who's naturally another scorer? Why the hell would I do that? Don't defend the rim. Don't defend the perimeter. Don't shoot the ball well. So what is going? What his what his career is banking on? Is this next coach being a miracle worker and them three, you know, them three flourishing? You know, do I expect him to do something big in free agency? Absolutely not. They Detroit definition of big in free agency and the actual definition of big in free agency is totally different. Every year they're going to make a big splash and they turn around and I don't know. And they sign some 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 dude. I don't know. Some dude. I don't know. Cam Sutton, you know, from no disrespect. No fucking big splash. Give a fucking, you know, this ain't like getting, we thinking Darrell Revis or Deion Sanders or Daryl Green. Jesus Christ. Shit, maybe even Joe Hayden in his prime. You know what I'm saying? So, really, what's going to, what is going to boil down for him, man, is those three get a, the chance to grow and develop. Um, Because I don't think he, no, I don't think he got a, I don't think he got the right architectural mind right now. I could be wrong. And if he does, will he be able to get those, those pieces to construct the team as needed, but um, but yeah, it's pretty much resting on them. It's pretty much resting on a lot of the rookie guys last year. The guys that were sophomores, those rookies with K, they took a step back last year. They can't afford for Jay Nivey to take anything step back. Everything has to be progressive. They can't afford to be battling and filling their fingers between Wiseman and Dern. They can't afford it. They need to push play on Dern. And, and and swipe left to whatever it is, swipe left with, with Wiseman. You need to get the keys to Dern, and then you hope K Cunningham. I seen an interview with his brother on Woodward Spur saying that, you know, that, you know, it might be a blessing to the spies. They've been working on the shooters' mechanics and, and certain things. They gonna need uh, they gonna need to give those guys every opportunity and um and hopefully they capitalize. And it's just really it's really gonna boil down to those three. Obviously, it does matter what they put around them and what they can put around them, but they really going to need a big two-year two-jump from Ivy and Dern, and they going to need Kay Cunningham to really, you know, make an all-star level jump just to say Troy Weaver job, just to be a 30-win team. Now, if he can go out there and put some good pieces behind him, like I said, Moses Moody, um, you know, maybe even a Kaminga. I don't like I don't like how he ain't shooting, but he could develop a shooter, a Porzingis. Uh, Cam Johnson, he could put some of those type of pieces around them. Then, I mean, yeah, they could probably could be really good, really fast. But um, I, I think he, I think he gonna be fired. If, if, if Tom Gores is 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 serious, 
and he don't and he don't get this coaching job right, head coaching uh, search job or head coaching vacancy right, and um and them do them, them it started with them three, and they don't really make a big leap, man. He gonna be gone. He ain't gonna be fired. He gonna be fired. So his future is really hinging on them. And in reality, you know, going back to that 2020 draft, you know, how different would it have been had he got hell burden at least? At least got hell burden. Who knows? But he did make up, you know, with Dern, he did make up with Ivy, he did make up with Cade. Now it's up to them. This summer, they should just be putting constant work in. They should be in constant communication. They should be working out. And Troy Weaver need to really look and say, how do I need to build this basketball team? Simple, Troy Weaver. You want three ND guys around them in that starting lineup. That's what you need. Guys that can defend their position on the wings and guys that can stretch the floor and catch and shoot. Anything else they give you outside of that is a bonus. But this is a franchise that need to get out of its own way. They keep trying to force ingredients that like white people no offense they keep trying to force ingredients to go into a, a meal that don't go like white people putting blueberries inside of a goddamn potato salad that's what he's trying to do you're trying to force blueberry killian blueberry bagley blueberry uh low sodium beef stew just cut bait with them put them at the end of the bench put them in the g league the e league the z league or cut them and just pay them like josh smith to go away your team gonna get better they don't fit and people some of this jerks walker guy hell no Look just like Isaiah Stewart and shoot just like that motherfucker. No. He go on to be a superstar somewhere else. Hey, more credit to him. I wish him nothing but the best. But no. None of them them tweener power forwards. I don't like none of them. Uh, kid, the, the Cam kid, the kid from US, UCF. I don't like none of them. Don't like them. We don't need no more motherfuckers to put the ball on the ground. We don't need it. We need you to defend, catch and shoot. <laughs> That's what we need. But yeah, you know, Troy Weaver future is hinging on Dern, Ivy, and Kate. And, you know, and in a way, Stewart and uh, Killian Hayes, low sodium beef Stewart and, 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 and uh, Frenchie boy. And I, what I mean by them is getting rid of their ass so other guys can grow. But hey, check out Detroit Piston Talk playlist. Thumbs up the video. Share the video. Subscribe to the channel. And the subscribe button is the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase your chance to get notifications. We go live or drop video. Financially want to support the channel. All my, and, or find me anywhere. Instagram, Cash App, Venmo, TikTok, whatever. Link tree, the first link in the description. Check out Detroit Piston Talk playlist for more videos like this. Peace.